Hi everyone. So, in the last session we discussed what is the basic things of modify operators, right? How to evaluate an expression, so which contains a modify operators. So, what are the main 5 steps we need to follow? What are the main 5 steps we need to follow? Evaluate the expression of a modify operators and uh, 2 basic examples we have seen. So, those programs describes. So, what is the difference between increment operator and decrement operator? We will see some more examples, right. So, exactly how a modify operators will execute, see. So, one example, so main int 3 variables, suppose x value 10, y value 20 and z and here it is a simple expression z is equals to x plus plus is multiplied with a minus minus y minus minus y and here it is so we are printing printf printf all the three variables x y z we are printing x y z so now this expression evaluation using 5 steps, same story. What is the first step? Pre increment and pre decrement. Here it is how many pre increments are there? No pre increment. How many pre decrements are there? Yes, pre decrement is there. Why? Decrease the value. Y value is 19. Y value 19. Next. Second step is substitution of values, just substitute the values, x value is 10 is multiplied with a y value 19. Second step over, third step evaluation, yes now expression is there evaluate, 10 is multiplied with a 19, value 190. Next step assignment, 190 the value assigned to z. So, now the z value is 190, 190 and the last step is post increments and post decrements. How many post increments are there and how many post decrements are there? See, this is post increment x. So, increase the x value, x value 11 and here it is any post decrement is not there. So, 5 steps over evaluation over. Next the control come to that next one x value. So, what is the x value 11 it will print. What is the y value 19 it will print and what is the z value 190 it will print. This is execution. Please do not get any confusion. If you take one expression which contains increment and decrement operators just follow these 5 steps. Okay? see the next example. Only one variable we are taking main int x is equals to 5, x is equals to 5 and this is the one, x is equal to x plus 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 x and here we are printing the x value printf x value we are printing in the next statement, right? How it executes? Just follow the same 5 steps once again. First step pre increment and pre decrement. How many pre increments are there? Only one pre increment is there that is plus plus x. So, x value becomes 6, very, very important thing. Whenever it is updated to 6, there is no 5, just forget about the 5. Now, x value is 6, 5 you are not storing in any other place. So, that is replaced by 6 in the memory. Now, x value is a 6. Come to that second step, substitution of values. Substitute the x value, right? What is that x value? 6. So, substitute 6 here and substitute 6 here also, not 5, no more 5 is already gone that is replaced with the value 6. Second step is over, third step evaluation, just evaluate add 6 plus 6 value 12, 
right next step is a assignment the 12 value will be assigned to x only so x value now 12 and the last step is post increment and post decrement in the expression here post increment is there now post increment executes x value is increased by 1 what is it x value is 12 that will become 13 now expression evaluation completed now finally in the last step we are printing the x value what is the x value is 13 x value is what 13 ok and see first post increment pre increment executes after pre increments substitution of values next evaluation and then assignment and the last step is a post increment so the final value is a 13 next example suppose here two variables we are taking now int a value is 2 b value is 3 b equals to a plus 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 b minus minus a equals to a minus minus plus 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 b and again b is equals to plus plus a plus minus minus b and finally we are printing the values of a and b we are printing the values of a and b now execution again every step nothing but every expression you should execute with the help of these five steps first step pre increment and pre decrement any pre increment and pre decrement no is not there so directly come to the second step substitute the values a value substitute 2 plus b value substitute 3 next evaluation 2 plus 3 5 next assignment so 5 will be assigned to b 5 will be assigned to b so what is the b value is now 5 and next last step post increment and post decrement post increment of a post increment of a post decrement of b so b value become 4 so after first expression evaluation so values are a value is a 3 and b value is a 4 and next here it is post and one is a pre so second expression execution same five steps we need to follow first plus plus b executes because pre increment and pre decrement first plus plus b means b value become 5 second step substitution of values a value substitute value is 3 plus b value is a 5 b value is a 5 and next step is evaluation 3 plus 5 8 next step is assignment 8 will go and store here into a so a value is 8 now and the last step is a value post decrement all the five steps very very important after assignment you are thinking that expression execution completed no last step is there post increment and post decrement so a value already 8 so that is post decrease that is become 7 second step completed now third step both are pre only one is a pre increment and second one is a pre decrement so pre increment and pre decrement plus plus a value become 8 minus minus b value become 4 next step substitution 8 plus 4 evaluation 12 assignment 12 will be assigned to b so b value is 12 and the last step is post increment and post decrement any post increment and post decrement here no so execution over so at last we are printing the values of a and b so here a value is a 8 
and b value is a 12 a value 8 and b value 12 ok. So, here so this is the program how it executes sir after execution of this program. So, where I did a mistake if I want to know I am unable to analyze. So, these many steps at a time no problem after every step you please write a printf a b values print here and a b values print here a b values print here a b values print here after every step if you print in which step you did the mistake that you will understand very easily ok. Suppose here it is printing that expected values what you expected the same values then there is no problem in this expression then you should go for second expression and next go for third expression and we will check the final. As a basic programmer if you are in a learning stage only so later anyway how many number of expressions no matter easily you will understand ok. So, this is a simply about a increment operators and decrement operators execution increment operators and decrement operators execution and one more simple point we will discuss right see what is that. See here C language is not the space consistent that is nothing but here a value is a 5 and then next step we are writing like this a equals to a plus 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 a the system will accept this expression. So, because how many number of plus symbols we are placing depend on that compiler internally will change nothing but will store will add some spaces to evaluate that expression. Here sir what is the confusion observe it will convert into two types a equals to a plus 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 a second one a equals to a plus 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 a two options we have sir how system will treat this one or this one when compare with the arithmetic operators modify operators only having highest priority when compare with the arithmetic operators modify operators having highest priority so first it will consider priority is given to modify operator a plus plus and then next priority is given to arithmetic operator so this is wrong actually if you evaluate this right what is the output you will get what is the output same 5 steps only you have to follow first one is a pre increment so nothing but a value becomes 6 6 will be substituted 6 plus 6 a value 12 you will get but come to here right same 5 steps we need to follow first post increment will not execute only pre increment so a value will substitute directly 5 plus 5 10 will be assigned later the value become 11 because the post increment is there. Sir which is the correct answer how system treats means this is the correct answer this is not reason it will give the first priority to modify operators when compare with the arithmetic operators. Arithmetic operator highest priority means arithmetic operator will come first right a modify operator is having highest priority. So, it is correct system treats like this ok. So, this is all about uh, modify operators increment and decrement operators hope everyone will enjoy this session right for more videos. So, please subscribe to Naresh IT channel thank you thank you all.